life force behind that body. Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to create art in just a few minutes. In today's digital world, we can create a picture, just type words on your keyboard, and the AI will be able to generate the images that match your ideas. So in this time, we are going to use Adobe Firefly. It is incredibly easy to use and completely free. I have made basic tutorial on how to add and change anything in my previous video. So let's open Adobe Firefly on browser or Google Chrome. Then select Explore Firefly. Scroll down until you see Generative View. So just before we start, make sure we enable the desktop site to get wide view. Let's upload your image, and here I want to change the background into something epic. So let's start background below to make selection on the background. I think it's really worked pretty well. And now let's type your text description. So I want something like post apocalyptic theme and tap generate. Just wait for Adobe Firefly to generate the images based on your description. And let's see how it works. Then you can choose which one the best. If you want to generate more images, tap more below. I think I'm gonna choose this one. And select keep to apply this. And we can generate another one. So as you can see, the background theme in this image is like the situation after a destructive disaster. So now I want to change the outfit of this guy to match the theme. Let's make selection over the outfit using insert tool. So I want to type armor suit and tap generate I think this one is the best for me and select keep the hand looks weird because AI failed to form this so I want to change to robot hand maybe it's much better ok it's really good and how about we add broken car on the background And I think I'm gonna add another stuff. Also, I'm going to use remove tool to get rid the particle. If we don't, let's save this image to gallery by click download button up on the right. As the final touch, I want to edit this image in Adobe Lightroom to add some basic adjustment and selective edit.
I think we have done a pretty good job here. I just can't believe that we can make this image just by type text on my keyboard. And this is another image that I'm using another text description. So that's my video. Thank you so much for watching. If you did like this video, please give me thumbs up. Check my artworks on my Instagram if you don't mind. I will see you later in the next video.